Hello my darling! Welcome to my channel. I'm your favorite Dr. Zita today again with a new pick up file reading. And today's topic you already know. We are going to know channeled message and love songs from your future spouse. Okay? So what song they are dedicating to you? Okay? And channeled message from your future spouse, more updated version, what they're telling you right now, what they're trying to tell you, what they're trying to send you messages, the type of things that they want you to know about themselves. Okay, let's go my group number one, two, and three, my pal one, two, and three. Find out what's really going on with your future spouse, okay? So if you're new to my channel, have no idea what's going on here, let me tell you. I am an intuitive tarot reader. I use my intuition and magical power to channel a message from angels and universe to guide you guys. This is purely intuitive based reading. So trust your intuition and trust your gut feelings in order to choose the perfect group for yourself, okay? And if you're drawn to more than one group, feel free to choose this group as well. Maybe you got some extra messages from angels and universe. Let's see my group number one or what the card you have. You have the clouds, okay? My group number one, you got the card of clouds. My group number two, you got the card of, okay, the roses. Let's see the roses. You got the card of roses and you got the card of child. So basically, pile number two, this is the card of the tarot deck that I'm using, okay? So... But it's uh, crazy that it just came out. So I will just take this card as there is the rose picture. So group number one is the cloud. Group number two is the rose. And group number three is the child. I will take this as well. The card is coming under the roses. So maybe there is something that this card wants to tell you. So let's take this card. And for pile number two, I'm going to take another card. Just to clarify the rose card, okay? Uh, a card for my pile number two, please. Okay, you got the star. Amazing. So, the star. Pile number one, cloud. Pile number two, star. Pile number three, the child. Let me give you the beautiful close-up look. But you can pause the video. Choose the proper group for yourself. I hope my darling you choose the perfect group for yourself. I'll give the timestamps in the description box. So go there, click on the timestamps, and the video will give you the exact timing when your pile is going to be started. If you're someone that you're not into my soul tribe, go ahead, subscribe, join in my family, become one of my darling because it gets a lot easier for me to pick your energy uh, the moment you become one of my darling. Okay, and and if you find it a bit difficult to choose pile through the cards, you can also choose pile through your zodiac sign. That I'm going to put in the description box. Go and click on the click on the description box. You will get your file selection through your zodiac signs. Okay. So let's not waste any time, my darling. Jump into your magical reading. Hello, my darling, my amazing group number one. Welcome, welcome to your magical reading. So you choose the cloud card, card number six. And the King of Pentacles, this is your reading. So, first of all, I'm picking up your person. is telling you first song I'm picking up that is Talking to the Moon. Yes, Talking to the Moon. Go and listen to the song Talking to the Moon, especially the lyrics, okay? I can see your person is someone, your future spouse. They're looking at the sky and trying to fantasize about you, trying to feel that how you look. Uh, what type of person you are, what you do. This person is really having strong fantasy world that includes you, my group number one. So my single darling, if you don't know your future spouse, this person also doesn't know you because the cloud talks about somehow your future spouse is confused that uh, if they will ever able to meet you or not, they're a bit... Um, let's say into the confusion okay the clouds talks about confusion where their visions are not clear but somehow they feel there's something beyond this confusion and there's you waiting for them so they believe it but sometimes you know some some situation really occurs that um, they stop believing in this but they are not hopeless they're still having a hope that you are out there manifesting them now with the clouds, the first song is talking to the moon. The second song is, uh, I'm picking up the songs where um, 
in a relationship with you feels like a fresh sky okay like the sunlight fresh sky white clouds and you and your person both of you are just walking in a beautiful garden okay or, or, or like lots of trees under the nature you guys are holding hands and seeing the beauty of nature and walking and they are telling you their stories you are telling them your stories okay your likes dislikes your vibe you know like some moments that your person who are not there with you but you wish that you can share this moment with your future spouse I can see uh, this type of song so whichever song give you that kind of vibe you can go and listen to the song because your future spouse is a natural lover like a natural lover they love natural beauty a lot so your person is all about nature lover sunlight and see the natural beauty with the loved one this is what they want okay so like traveling seeing new places going out with you and enjoy the sunlight enjoy the moonlight as well especially in the full moon night this is what your person truly want and that's why the clouds are here the clouds are like thoughts that is kind of not helping them to see what is coming to them because your person is just not right now thinking too much okay group number one your future spouse is thinking too much that if they will ever be able to meet you or not so yeah lots of thinking going on in their mind but they want to meet you they want to have this connection with you but yes the clouds um oh cloud nine you met me on cloud nine so something like um beyond the magic or beyond the physical logical thing so my group number one you are the fairy godmother for your future spouse or fairy godfather okay depending on your gender so you are that that uh, fairy like the wizard magician uh, you know the witch magical person for them my group number one and your future spouse is someone they are very much vintage classy okay I'm picking up a very classy person a classical lover okay and maybe they're really drawn to those uh, kind of 70s or 80s music yeah or you know those um this early 90s music this is what they want or like late 80s and early 90s music this is what they want okay wow y y y your person is a very classy a man or a very classy woman that you're attracting uh, because I'm picking up that uh, you know they, they want to go out go out on a date with you and that date is uh, happening in a very classy restaurant or hotel and things are just perfect the candlelight the class is there the high standard things are there even if you guys want to go out and buy car or by bike and having a ride with them yes this is also what your person is fantasizing right now they're very classy my group number one okay whatever they do a very classy person is coming into your life now let's see my beautiful group number one that um what your person is telling you right now okay what your what your future spouse is trying to tell you right now yes they are manifesting the marriage with you okay your person telling you that i'm waiting for our marriage i'm waiting for our marriage i can't wait to marry you i can't wait to be with you it's just i'm waiting for you too much i am just watching lots of waiting picture of others I am watching the songs that in a waiting I will play or I'm just you know uh, planning my waiting playlist something like that because four of wands is the card of marriage is the card of uh, waiting manifestation this is the card where your person is telling you that I'm ready for this union I'm ready for this connection I'm coming to you I'm coming to marry you I'm coming to 
have this magical connection with you i can't wait anymore so let's just go and get married so my group number one i better say that you are not only attracting your uh, boyfriend or girlfriend it is a husband or wifey material that you are attracting and your future spouse the point they will see you they're like okay my vision is crystal clear i know who i want in my life i know i want my beautiful group number one and i want to get married as fast as possible so group number one expect a lot of like fast moving energy from your person and they are ready to marry you they are ready to be with you no matter what i can see a marriage is really entering in your life with the four of wands a four of wands wand is a very fast moving energy as well as it talks about a very private cozy warm celebration where you and your future spouse both of you are keeping it very private the wedding and the ceremonies uh, the celebration okay let's see what your person is telling you right now what they're telling you right now yes ten of wands your person is someone that uh, telling you my group number one i have been working so hard for past few years i have already i've already spent too much energy on my work i know what i'm capable of doing i'm done taking responsibility of others now it's time for me to take my own responsibility on my own shoulder so that i can start a new relationship with you i cannot think anymore i am an overthinker i just want to be with you because this person my beautiful group number one this person is like i have been doing so many things for other people so they are quite philanthropist you know helping other people charitable and giving other people new ideas that how to overcome any challenges so your person is telling to you right now that it's time for me to listen to my advice it's time for me to do something for myself and i'll try my best to find the perfect partner for myself with the ten of wands like i'm tired of being taking responsibilities of other people now it's time for me to take my own responsibility your person loves to hugs you a lot i can see a great 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 person who loves to give you warm big hugs and going to add a squeeze at the end of each hug yeah this is exactly what your person is going to give you somebody who is very happy that you are with them my group number 1 uh, what your person is telling you that uh, where are you now I'm faded. So I'm faded. That is also your song. It's like they're finding you. My group number one. Okay, so yeah, I'm faded. Where are you now? Uh, you can go and listen to the song because it's kind of give me that uh, what they're thinking about their life, your future spouse. Okay, that I'm just. I'm just finding you. I'm just searching for you. I'm just trying to find a proper way to get to you. This is what I'm picking up. Okay, your person, your future spouse. Also, your person is someone uh, like um, if I try to know their soul song, like what their soul is singing. I can see the song of Michael Jackson like uh beat me hit me you can never kill me that is the song <laughs> I hope I'm right so go and listen to the song okay they don't really care about us this is the song name just go and listen especially uh, read the li lyrics okay your person is someone they're like I will do whatever I'm here to do. This is my life purpose. I don't even care if I'm in your good list or not, if I'm in your good book or not, because I will keep on be me, okay? I will never change myself. So, this is what I'm picking up also one of the thing with the 10 of wands. And the 4 of wands. 
Your person could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Also the fourth zodiac, that is the Cancer, and tenth zodiac, the Capricorn. This person could have this kind of, I know, placement somewhere. Sun, Moon, or Rising. Okay. Um, with the Cancer, I can see that they, they could be July born. Or with the Capricorn, you know, the Capricorn zodiac timeline. So, okay. Hmm. Let's see what your person is telling you. Wow, I love this card. The Queen of Cups. Your person is the Queen of Cups. They're ready to give you love. They are ready to give you love. I can see your person is the love, love, love. They're going to love you, nurture you, nourish you. And you know what? Queen of Cups is the energy where they are here to give you love. And they are not looking that what you are giving them. They're not looking for it. It's all about I am doing my own part and I want to spoil my group number one. I want to give my group number one the attention, the love, the nurturing vibe that they need. And all the rest will follow it. Because your person tr truly believes that if they give something, then universe will return it to them as well. So they don't need to worry that how it will work. But it will work. Your person is telling you with the Queen of Cups energy. It's like... Wow, your future spouse, what they're telling you. Mm. Mm. I was getting the song, it's like, um, I love you for infinity. I love you for infinity, that is the song, that is one of the songs I'm picking up, your person is telling you. Also, their love is like, they're loving you and loving you and loving you doesn't even matter if you love them back or not so your person is very good at unrequited love wow and it's so hard okay it's not so easy okay to be a one-sided lover when you know that your love is not reciprocated in the same way but your person is someone they can do it because they cannot stop loving you so but you also love them don't worry <laughs> so your person they give without expecting anything in return so you can go those songs where like a hopeless romantic person is singing a song for their lover and telling them that you i don't care if you love me or not because i will always love you mm, i will always love you okay that, that was a song i think so I will always love you. There is a song, right? Yeah, so listen to the song as well. Maybe read the lyrics, something okay, similar that your person is trying to tell you that I will always love you. Oh, wow, I will always love you. Amazing song. Wow. I will always love you. Okay, I got that song. Let's see the same. Okay, you got the page of cups. Look at that. You got the page of cups. So now here, your person is telling you that they believe in destiny, they believe in fate. They believe that uh, all is written in the star, okay? Our, our destiny is already written by God. So whatever we are going to have, it's already fixed. This is how your person sees these things. And with the Page of Cups, your person truly believes that uh, we got a red thread connection, okay? I will get married in this lifetime if my soulmate or if my divine partner is born if they're not born how can i get married okay so this is your person's explanation of marriage and this kind of sacred union with their partner so with the page of cups your person is like protecting their love only for you and giving you love and everything that you've been wishing for and your person is like Wow, I can see many people really want them, but your person doesn't feel a connection with them. So your person can really reject lots of people very easily. Okay. So you can also listen to the song uh, by Ariana Grande, "Into You." I'm so into you. Okay, I'm so into you. Yeah, that is the song I'm picking up. Also, your person, like their soul song, if I get a song that kind of describes them. Um, let's see. 
I'm picking up your person is someone that they are fine by themselves. It's like they are not that desperate of getting married, okay? Uh, because they're fine by themselves. They're not so much crazy for love, but they're crazy for the true relationship, the true union where it is written by the star and it's already divine. So a person is really waiting for that kind of love and they know that this kind of love comes only once in a lifetime. But they can wait for it. Your person is like, yeah, I can wait for the right love. Because right love is far more better than the early wrong love, okay? <laughs> Let's see what's going on here, okay? If I can get any song more to give you, okay? Mm. Let's see, my darling, what type of relationship you're going to be having with your person. Okay, so you got the card of receiving. Look at that. You got the card of receiving. I open up and allow myself to receive love in all ways, from all directions. It may seem scary, but it's better than receiving audits, bed bugs, or head mail. I receive love, and it feels so good that I decide to receive it some more, and then some more, and maybe just a wee bit more. Okay. So my group number one, the thing is, you were always ready for marriage, but some of the blockages were coming from your future spouse. I can feel the energy where your person is almost closed off or not so much open for love. But right now you're watching this video, it is a confirmation that your person is opening the arms for love, for you spiritually they are opening up spiritually they are claiming that i am ready for marriage i'm ready for something more than just a friendship i'm ready for a relationship and your person is about to meet you because of that because i can see that the blockages were coming from your future spouse where they were not so ready to be married but you are so much ready for the marriage okay uh, you also got this card of the open heartedness i told you look at that i shuffled open heartedness i know that life and the people living it can be absolute bummer sometimes boomer sometimes but i promise not to let unhappy chapters make me jaded if i let negative experience turn me sour then the jerks win so I'll move on with an open and hopeful heart if only because I hate losing to jerks. So I can see my group number one because of some people your person truly closed off for several years and now they're just you know giving themselves the idea that why should I give up on love because of those jerks because of those people who made me disappointed in relationship but this is not the whole world is all about okay my parents other people are really having a very happy life then why two or three people are changing my whole life philosophy i should not change my life because of those little experience that i got from those jerks okay i'm not i'm not going to change myself so here my group number one as i told you just before getting this open-heartedness card that your person right now they're changing their mentality they're like i'm open for love i'm open for new love i'm waiting for my love i'm waiting for the person to sweep me off to sweep me off my feet and give me the love show me the world okay i'm waiting for this kind of person so you can go and listen to the song, whatever gives you that kind of vibe, like I'm waiting for you, I'm ready for you, I'm wishing you in my life, I'm praying for you, I am manifesting you, I am dreaming of you and I know you are out there, you can feel me. So this kind of songs, okay. Your person right now, they're like closing a chapter and jumping into a new chapter. And this new chapter is all lovey-dovey, romantic, sweet with you. Okay? It's all lovey-dovey, romantic, sweet with you. Let's see. 
let's see more what your person is telling you okay so you got the card of reliability I'm reliable when I say I'll do something I'll, I take whatever that something is seriously that applies to all commitments even ones that may seem small and insignificant to a less reliable me from now on flaking is just <laughs> commercial and CEO factories oh my god so my group number one your person is like I'm reliable I'm always on time so believe in divine timing I am the keeper I'm the promise keeper if I promise you something my group number one I'll keep my promise doesn't even matter if I'm alive or dead I will keep my promise okay so this person is like I will always try my hundred percent to keep my promise to you okay and somehow my group number one the situation the people kind of act so much against your person that your person is like what I'm receiving being so reliable and trustworthy for others people are still cheating on me why do why do i have to be the keeper when there's no one who wants me to keep them so your person's mentality was kind of changed or let's say kind of hampered by others negativity okay some damage was created okay because of some disappointment because of some kind of negative energies but right now your person is healing and they can feel it now if I am reliable enough to keep people's promise to keep my partner promise the universe will send me the person where I can just show my reliability and other one is so much happy with it so your person right now they're starting believing in energies and other things like energy never lies your vibe never lie it can tell you so many things this is what's happening here let's see my beautiful group number one some message for you regarding this connection what you need to know yes your person could be a capricorn even i told you the capricorn energy at the initial part of the reading so your person could be a capricorn sun moon are rising or they could have the capricorn energy what is the capricorn energy capricorn energy is a very earth energy down to earth realistic logical okay this person is analytical workaholic they love their work very much hard working person your future spouse also your future spouse is just like a sugar daddy or sugar mommy they love to spoil you they love to give you a gift they love to you know show you that whatever i can afford i will try to give you the best luxurious things because i want to spoil you and i want to give you the best life whether you're watching for a woman or a man it is the same for you Capricorn is also the energy where your person is materialistic, yes, but also somehow having the balance of down to earth. They are extremely down to earth and they know what they're doing. Okay? Uh, down to earth energy and never brag about their own things. Capricorn people, okay? Uh, let's see. Okay, this card is jumping. You also got the Aquarius. Capricorn Aquarius, it could be you, it could be your future spouse, but your person got this Aquarius energy, collaborate. Now, with the collaborate collaboration card, I can see your future spouse is someone, they are a giver. Okay, they are a giver, they love to give. Whether it's a knowledge, money, their gift, or something that can nourish you, your person is ready to give you that thing. They are extremely having the sacrificing energy in them. They can sacrifice anything for you. Now here in this relationship, I can see your connection with your future spouse is going to be very strong, disciplined, having a well-structured and long-term. Because both Aquarius and Capricorn ruled by Saturn. Saturn is all about long-term connection that has longevity. So your relationship with your future spouse that has strong longevity and can see a very much reliable person is coming for you where you can trust them this person is going to love your weirdness doesn't even matter how weird are you this person find it very much exciting and seductive as well your weirdness something that other people find it a very odd but your person is like oh my god this is the reason i fall in love with my group number one let's see a guidance card for you wow your 
Krishna is guiding you. Look at that Lord Krishna. Okay, let me show you the card. Lord Krishna is guiding you. I'm blessed with the abundant power of good health, peace and well-being. I am powerful and have unlimited wealth. I enjoy chants and music to awaken happiness and love within me. I am famous, well respected and beautiful. Wisdom and knowledge are integrated within my being. And you got the card of Covelite. Do you recognize your inner beauty and divinity? Are you ready to claim your power? It is safe for you to reveal your fame and wisdom to others. Use sound and vibration to awaken love, inner peace and kindness. You have a positive influence on those around you. Embrace your attractiveness and shine your light for all to see. So my beautiful group number one, your relationship filled with happiness, wealth, money, success, music, influence, name, fame, popularity, wish fulfillment, dream fulfillment, also lots of divinity. It's a divine connection, my group number one. Okay, so whatever you're wishing to God, whatever you're wishing for, your every wish is going to come true. Whatever, whatever that your wish is, my group number one, get ready to get that wish fulfillment, dream fulfillment. That's all I got for you, my beautiful group number one. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Give it a thumbs up. Also, my darling, subscribe to my channel. Become one of my darling. I love you so much. My darling, my amazing group number two. Welcome, welcome to your magical reading. So this is group number two. If you saw the shuffling part um, to find the star card, before the star card, I got the rose card. Okay, that is the main page of this tarot deck. So when I got the rose card, it's kind of give me the vibe, like your relationship, your future spouse, they're very romantic, very much romantic and they're going to sing for you, uh, recite for you, paint for you something or maybe just, you know, dedicate you some songs all the time, okay, they want to go out on romantic dates, candlelight dinner, movie, shopping or they want to spend time with you, like long drive, or watching the stars with you okay walking on the beach whatever romantic romantic thing or thing or romantic scene can be created your future spouse is ready for all types of experience or for some of you my group number two your person want to recreate something like a legendary movie scene legendary romantic movie scene your person wants to create that thing with you as well now you choose the beautiful star card and the star is all about being inspired or seeking one's goals. So your person is extremely goal oriented and they will find you inspiring. Also the star talks about universe, navigate, astrology, science, destiny, goal, intuition, influence, ideas, talent, vast, infinite, imagination, guidance, hope clarity vision and inspiration so my beautiful group number two you are the inspiration for your future spouse some of them find you that you are the ideal type you are the partner that they can do anything just to make sure that you are in, in do that you're impressed by them this person is ready to impress you this person is ready to do anything to make you feel that uh, they can do anything to make you stay with them okay now let's see my beautiful group number uh two okay channel songs okay i'll keep on channeling whatever i receive i'll tell you wow i can see your future spouse uh, may love the regional songs okay so if their mother tongue is not english then they're not going to drawn to those uh, english pop songs i hope you understand if they're having different kind of mother tongue, they're into those kind of regional uh, songs, okay? Romantic songs that I'm picking up. Wherever your person is coming from, okay? This is the vibe I'm picking up. So, let's see. But I'll try to get the um, whole idea, the meaning of the song and everything. Oh my God. <laughs> your person's favorite song is Despacito. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, so yeah so your person is very much drawn to those um 
uh, Latin songs. I don't know why, but um, I'm picking up the songs of like Mexican songs, uh, like you know, Mexican Latino or those um, okay, those Brazilian songs are also here, like songs from Brazil. Wow. What I'm picking up right now, or you know those African um, pop song, African English songs. I hope you understand. So that kind of song, your person is very much drawn to. Under the influence. Wow. Okay. This is one of the thing that your person is telling you. Wow, your person is very much like trendy. Okay. <laughs> but let's see. Uh, let's see uh, your person they're, what they're trying to tell you wow i love this so you got these two cards look at that you got the lovers with the seven of pentacle what a beautiful combination so with this flamingo card it's kind of giving me the beach vibe beach energy okay so you and i uh, you and i in hawaii yeah that is also a song um are kind of like beach vibe beach energy your person want to go to go to watch and sunset this person is into sunset okay um they love beach areas a lot ocean a lot okay wow the lovers you, you, your person truly believe that uh, there there is you okay you are the soulmate your, your person truly believe in the soulmate connection and your person is like i can wait okay they're telling you that i can wait for eternity for my beautiful group number two i'm not going to invest my time i'm not going to invest my love on people who is not my soulmate i'm not into just any kind of relationship i want my soulmate in my life so your person is into that kind of soulmate relationship soulmate connection this is what they want hmm. my beautiful group number two okay soulmate kind of connection soulmate kind of relationship with the lovers and the seven of pentacles your person is like uh, slow but they love the slow burn like slowly slowly getting into a relationship slowly slowly learning things about each other loving each other not getting bored of each other this is what they like okay this is what they want wow eight of cups look at that eight of cups it is an energy like they can let go of anything and anyone just to be with you So the songs that kind of include that kind of thing like I can let go of anything I can let go of anyone anything any situation I can do anything just to be with you so if I try to find your future spouse soul song or the song that really represent themselves or the way they're dealing with life it's like I will still rise by Katy Perry. Why? Why am getting the her song? Maybe a person love her song. Okay. I will still rise. Go and listen to the song. I will still rise. Wow. Okay. Your person is all about that, you know. I, it doesn't even matter that how life is throwing challenges at me. I can deal with it. I can work with it. I can just win over every challenge and everything. I will have my own shortcut to get to the success, to get to my destination. Okay, with the Eight of Cups and Seven of Pentacles. Okay, this person is very good at renewing their life. I can see. So this is a song is like imi 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 imi. Okay, you know this song. You can just go and read the English lyrics if you if you just cannot understand the language. Then you will see uh, that the song is all about like you should let go of someone who is not 
uh, valuing you and giving you the love that you have been deserving why you're killing yourself for that person you should move on you should get love yourself you should go and get going move on with your life move forward your person is someone like that okay they're like I'm not going to shed a tear for someone who doesn't even care about my feelings why would I shed my valuable tear for them I won't Wow, your person is really having a high self-respect, high self-value. Wow. You got the high priestess card and this kind of, kind of give me the vibe. But your person is a king or the queen and they will decide that how things will happen in your life. Okay, so we did the high priestess card. I can see like um, what your future spouse is telling you. They're telling you that maybe I don't say it out loud, but I can hear everything. Whether you say things to me or not, I can read the line in between. I can read the things that you are not telling me, even you don't know that how to read yourself i can read you your person is telling you these things so my group number two you know some some experience something that you cannot describe with words your future spouse can read it your future spouse can sense it your future spouse can feel it that exactly how you're feeling and exactly what you are trying to tell them so they can feel it your person is telling you that I'm, I'm highly sensitive. I'm highly sensitive and I know, I know what's, what's really going on. I know what is exactly you are thinking. I know exactly what's, what you are ready to offer me. So They're traveling towards you. Six of Swords. I can see relocation. I can see traveling. I can see this person is like moving from one place to another to be with you. Okay, I'm in love with the shape of you. Shape of you is one of the songs I'm picking up. A person is telling you that they were not so sure to meet you or to get the love from somewhere, from a place that is so much unexpected. So it is a very unexpected meeting. Maybe a place where naturally lovers don't meet. Or the place where it's it's very awkward to find your true love there. So that that kind of thing I'm picking up. Mm. Wow, nine of pentacle. I love this. A bachelor. Okay, so this person is bachelor. They're not into any kind of relationship. Your future spouse, they're not into any kind of relationship right now. Whenever, wherever you watch this video, they are single okay they're doing with your life they're doing with their life they're single they're not in a relationship this person is all about oh my god i don't know what to do with life i don't know where to find love i'm just be myself let's see where god is leading me wow so what romantic songs what songs kind of show that they love you Universe, what song my group number two future spouse is sending them? Just the two of us, even I. Okay, you can go and listen to the song as well. You can also listen to the song that. Wow. Your person really listen to the pop songs I'm picking up. Or maybe um, wherever they're coming from, like their language, and like the song with you know beat and drums and Spanish, and know uh, the like guitar that like a uh, very like you know like metallic or a very like strong tune. Your person love that kind of music, like the bang bang music. Yeah, they enjoy this a lot. Okay, you can also listen, listen to the song bang bang. It is a Bollywood song. If you're into that, you can also listen to the song Bang Bang. Okay? I forgot the name of the movie, but yeah, the song Bang Bang. 
रात भर बात कर दैट दैट इज़ अ सॉन्ग ओके इफ यू आर इन टू हिंदी यू कैन वॉच दैट यू नो यू कैन वॉच दैट सॉन्ग एंड फाइंड आउट द लिरिक्स वट योर पर्सन वन डू टू यू और हाउ लाइक नो हाउ दे आर दस डूइंग थिंग्स इन द रिलेशनशिप और समथिंग लाइक दैट और स्पेशली दर फीलिंग्स टूअर्ड्स यू इफ यू आर नॉट हिंदी स्पीकर इट्स नॉट फॉर यू ओके I'm just telling mm, my beautiful group number 2 let's see romantic songs or the songs especially the songs um wow your person loves to watch comedy movies and action movies yeah this is what they like okay Like yeah, comedy movies and action movies. This is what they like. Especially the love in the comedy movies. This is the most favorite thing uh, that they want to watch. Wow, you you your future spouse want to become a great mother or father in the future. Okay, and they also want to treat you like a baby as well. You are their baby as well, my group number two. But let's see, let's see more. What's really happening here? Okay, your person, the type of relationship you're gonna be having with them, or something that your person is telling you right now. What's your your person is telling you right now? Wow, maturity! I love this card. I love this card. Maturity. Look at that. Look at that. I make peace with the tough relationship of my past. I probably would have skipped the pain they came with, but I'm grateful for the lessons they brought me. Because of those tough relationships, I can look back at the mosaic of my life and see value in even the most broken piece. Okay. So your person is someone very much mature. Okay? They are mature. they can be very merciful okay this is a person who is very much kind hearted they are merciful they forgive people very easily your person truly believe that there's no point of holding any kind of grudges in your heart against anyone that has no point you just make your heart feel more loaded nothing nothing else okay you should let it out if you can't let it out don't hold it back Okay, <laughs> this is what your person truly believe, and they're also telling you to let go of any thoughts that is connected to your past, and don't feel sad or bad about your past because you did your best. Because you know your person is telling you, okay, this is the this is the life lessons. Like when they thought that they're going through a very happy time, that was the worst time in their life. and after that they really finding out that oh my god that was the lesson time for me but i thought that was the blessing time for me maybe it was a blessing but blessing in this guys this is how your person's life philosophy is this is their way of looking uh, has changed um so your person is someone they're just uh, trying to come back to their core basic they're trying to find my try they're, they're trying to find themselves again in many broken pieces and they're just adding each piece to themselves and creating the best version of themselves wow So, uh, can we get a song that really represent your person's soul, or the soul song, or what they're doing? Okay. Mm. <laughs> wow. I'm picking up a song uh, from the Shrek, I guess. Like, I need the hero, and your person is the hero, <laughs> or heroine, whoever they are. Your person love to listen to the song, or they really vibe with the song. Like this is the final countdown. This is also a song because I'm picking up two songs. This is final countdown. I don't know what that is. What the 
the thing that they really um, want to get but this is final countdown that they're changing they're becoming the best version of themselves angels said they are helping them uh, they're not lost they thought that they're lost but they're not lost and also the song that I need a hero mm. okay these two songs I'm picking up so I told you or that kind of song that kind of music that they like okay let's see um, what is there for you more like your future spouse or something that you like something from uh, your future spouse something about your person my beautiful group number two what's really you're having let's see okay this one I got the okay I got the transit card the climate so here I can see your future spouse could come from a place where the climate is kind of different from yours so there is changing going on so maybe your person is changing their location or they're traveling or they're relocating or they're just changing their home and this is how you guys are meeting or this is really happening right now with your future spouse okay they're changing something okay they're just coming out of something they're changing something in their life i can see that also i got the card of aquarius okay aquarius collaborate you and your person both of you literally believe that relationship occurs when you give and take when you just offer love and receive love oh wow i just realized you got two angel number five five and eleven eleven look at that five five and one one so angel number five 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 one 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 if you see this five five also talks about change transition okay um moving forward moving on getting your dreams uh and also number one one talks about you're just pouring love into yourself becoming the best version of yourself loving yourself to the most this is what's happening uh with your future spouse but also your person I'm picking up they're not so good with the changes you know though they're changing still they're like oh my god I don't I hate changes your person hate changes okay though look at that definitely your person right now look at that progression and journey so it could be physical journey mental journey or they're moving on from someone or something they're coming out of any kind of addiction or something that was not really helping them to become a best version though it's difficult but your person is doing this so right now maybe your person is listening to the song that usually people listen while traveling or journey related to the song like going somewhere okay mm. wow I just got a song, it's a Bollywood song that is Me La Pata. Me La Pata. You can go and listen to the song. And um, also, what song I'm picking up? Okay, that was the song. Tani, can I be your favorite? Mm -hmm. You can go and listen to the song as well that your person is giving you. Also, I'm picking up the song. What was the song name? Okay, so the song is like um, okay, Stereo Love. <laughs> oh my God, yes, Stereo Love. That was the song name. So I'm picking up Stereo Love. I'm also picking up the song that um, it must have been love. Okay, it must have been love. Stereo Love. Okay, and also I'm picking up the song like closer you can go and listen to the, to the song of closer by chain smoker okay and this is the songs i am picking up already for you my beautiful group number two okay let's see the last but not least the message card from god whatever is there for you my beautiful group number two let's see my darling, if you're not into my soul tribe, go and subscribe so that I can pick your energy more accurately. Become one of my darling. Let's see my beautiful group number two. Okay. 
you got the opal crystal let's see it's all about do you enjoy scholarly activities and mind bending projects do you have a brilliant mind that craves stimulation it is time to embrace concepts that may seem at first glance far out of the ordinary activate your higher mind by taking the time to further your education embrace the power of knowledge also you got this message from uh, sanat kumara that is i am an intelligent being i'm smart enough to be aware that new information is always available for discovery deep wisdom is innate within me my entourage of angels orchestrates my life i am receptive and have gift of insight so my beautiful group number two in this relationship i can see that you are tapping into your wise version okay your mature version where you can see things that how it's coming into your life where you can see how things are happening how things are unfolding in front of you so yeah quite intriguing i can see that you are um like in this relationship you are really finding out lots of hidden talent that you already got in yourself but never knew that you got it so yeah that is the thing that's all i got for you my beautiful group number two i hope you enjoyed this reading and if you're not into my soul type go ahead and subscribe for more i love you so much my darling my amazing pile number three welcome welcome to your magical reading so you choose this beautiful card of the child so this is the card number 13 okay so yeah one three thirteen so here with the child i can see well catching the butterflies so your future spouse what they're telling you they are telling you that you are my pile number three believe it or not you are like the butterfly you're like a social butterfly everybody wants you everybody want to catch you but you are you are not easy to catch it's like one play one time you're here the next second you are somewhere else so you are someone you can just um you're just like the magic okay though they can see you but don't know that when where how you will come into life so with a child i can see child like energy inner child is active innocent purity i can see uh, ambition also believe in the magic believe in the magical world your future spouse some of them feel like that magic is real miracle happens everything is real if i want it truly i can get anything i want and they have the eyes to see the wonders the magic this person believes that everything is possible your future spouse believe that they're going to get you they're going to get their dream partner so you are their dream partner and they believe that i will get my dream partner because i believe that take a leap of faith is the thing that can get you anything first you need to trust god and jump from the cliff god will catch you or teach you how to fly because god will never ever let you go god is always there with you so this is the child card i'm picking up that your person is someone that they are really looking up to you like you are the magical fairy or angel like you are the wondrous thing that they have been waiting for so my beautiful pile number three let's see let's see um what is here so one of the like in a romantic song i'm picking up love me like you do la la love me like you do touch me like you do ta ta touch me like you do what are you waiting for that is your song my pile number three <laughs> your person is giving you that song that song okay so you know what your future spouse is telling you one thing that don't change <laughs> Do not change pile number three the way you are. Do not change yourself. Do not like yes, update yourself, upgrade yourself. We grow each and every day. That's good. We polish ourselves, that's great. But do not change your core. Do not change for the sake of people, okay? Do not check do not change just to please people because I love the way you are. I love this version of yours so much. Wow. Pile number three, your person is telling you that the way you used to be, the way you used to do things, keep on doing things that way. I love it that way. 
I enjoy it that way. I want you that way. Do not change. Okay? Just be yourself. You don't have to fit into any kind of box. You don't have to deem your light to fit in. You don't have to do something that is not your comfort zone, but you're doing it just for the the standards that society make. I don't care what other people think. I care what you think, my parameter. If you're happy with yourself, I'm happy for you. Okay, because I am happy when you are happy. So let's see what your what your person is telling you. Let's see. Let's see your person starts what they're telling you. Okay. Wow. Look at the hat man. I'm waiting for you. This person is waiting for you. And they're patient. I love this energy. Pilamit, your person is like, take as much as time you need. I can wait. I will always wait for you. I can wait for you. Eternity. Okay. I can wait for you. I have always been waiting for you. I don't want a relationship if that is not you. So this person is like, I will wait for you. I'll never ever leave you. So like everything I do, you can go and listen to the song, Everything I Do. You can also listen to the song that uh, Heartbeat. You know, there, 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 there's a song called Heartbeat. You can go and listen to the song as well. King and Queen of Hearts. I'm picking up that song as well. A King and Queen of Hearts. Okay. Well, let's see. Uh, with the hangman, it also shows confidence that your person is having on you. Okay, your future spouse is very much confident. They know that whatever you're doing, this is something that you like to do and it's okay for them. If you're happy, they're happy too. Wow, five of cups. Ooh, ooh. They are sad if you're sad. Your person is also disappointed if you're disappointed. Okay, so pile number three somehow right now your future spouse is feeling that they got no chance to be with you because of the because because you know this person is really uh, weeping because the three cups are spilled and can't get things that is already broken but not able to look backwards that there is also chances for her for this person to overcome so here my beautiful part number three your person some of feel that they got no chance with you left like they can't be with you because of blah 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 reason okay they feel like oh my god i'm losing the game i'm waiting for you but here part number three i i think you're with someone i think you're not waiting for me i think you're you're just Let's say I lost you. Okay, I lost you. Or okay, like sound like I lost. Okay, this is the feeling I'm picking up. Okay, maybe a person. Okay, maybe your future spouse is getting some kind of negative vibe from someone, or someone is there trying to send wrong messages to your future spouse that you are not waiting for them, or there's nobody waiting for them, or they're not going to get whatever they're dreaming. I can see a person is really trying very hard to fight with the devil card because look at this is crazy because I got the devil in the bottom of the deck and after I remove the devil card I can see the nine of cups it's a wish fulfillment card so I'm picking up that um, pilot three your future spouse as I told you with the hat man they are ready to wait for you they are ready that yes I know I will meet my parliament three because this is my destiny. I'm not going to lose hope. I'm not going to show my impatience to the universe. No, because I'm truly not impatient. I know things will happen in the perfect divine timing. But the devil energy is kind of creating the illusion in front of your person and showing them that you're late. Nobody's coming for you. Okay, you have got to wake up in the reality. This is not for you. You're not going to get this kind of negativity. Your person is receiving maybe from someone 
or maybe by watching something very much negative okay and they're crying over something okay it could be the case that your person is watching a series or a movie or maybe something is going on with their friend and they can relate to it that's why they're feeling kind of disappointed but here I can see the king of wands that they're coming back to their own core very easily they're coming back to their sunny positivity very easily like the phoenix card like they're getting birth by their own ashes so though the disappointments are coming um, for a few times and um, but they're, they're also going away okay hmm. I'm also picking up the song is like um, take me to your heart okay take me to your heart I'm also picking up that like endless love okay you can go and listen to the song endless love king and queen of hearts I think I told you you can also listen to the song that how deep is your love how deep is your love okay and if you're into like Bollywood songs you can go and listen, listen, listen to the song Sun Satya Sun Satya you know that song right if you know you know hmm. so someone picking up that um, whenever your person feels like that it's time to um, like when, whenever your person is getting disappointed in their dreams or something like that but then the king of wands is coming so God is always showing the light God is always there to turn their head and look at that you that they got opportunity that they got time to meet you but somehow your person they're just um, very much emotional and they can relate themselves to anything like this person is all about like shapeshifter they can feel people's emotion they can feel what others are going through so deeply look at that the five of sword yes like though the five of sword is just the illusion okay it's not true if, if you know the story you know um the story of overseas and everything so you know he's not dead but it's kind of like the false news that he's dead but he's not okay so here in my parameter three your person is like your future spouse is really thinking right now that they don't have any chance to be with you. If they know you or don't know you, doesn't even matter. But uh, some of them feel like this person is really getting the vibe, like their dream is not coming true. Because you know, the last step of manifestation is that God give you the signs that things are not coming for you. Everything is falling apart. Everything is wasted you're done nothing is coming and then boom suddenly next day your manifestation is standing in front of you this is how it works this is how universe wants you to test okay and wants to test you and wants you to know that universe is just testing you so right now your future spouse is going through that testing period where universe is kind of giving them some illusion that things are not working things are not happening everything is like uh, the waste oh my god i'm lost i'm not having anything but boom again you know the, the air is clear and your person can see that they're exactly on the right path of meeting you and having this connection okay so it's like a revive energy it's like a restart renew revive refreshment change rebirth that i'm picking up my beautiful pet number three okay that your person is someone they're just coming back to their own core okay i got the queen of pentacle and the king of pentacle though i cannot show you the queen of pentacle look at this you got the queen of pentacle and the king of pen the ace of pentacle so here i can see a person is ready for the new love they are ready for the new love they are ready for this beautiful connection and your person is like, I am ready for the connection. Why 
Why my person is not coming in my life? Why? I am so much ready for love. Mm. Wow. I'm also picking up that um, your your future spouse is telling you that no matter what, I will wait for you, and I will go and find you. So you can go and listen to the song "Circle of Life." Circle of Life, just to get some more insight about your person's feelings or something like that, or what's going on. Uh, circle of life you can also go and listen to the song i see the light circle of light i see the light these two songs also i'm picking up the song like um <laughs> i don't know why suddenly i'm picking up the song hakuna matata <laughs> my land king it's like everything is fine you don't have to worry all is well <laughs> yes yeah, so your person is like one time they are getting disappointed and the next your person is like all is well i will get it whatever is meant for me i'll get it i don't have to worry about anything else i will get it you can also listen to the song a whole new world by aladdin like aladdin and jasmine a whole new world um you also Listen to the song that Into the Unknown. Into the Unknown. Okay. Into the Unknown. The whole new world. Hakuna Matata. Just to give their energy. Like what is exactly going on. Okay. Mm Also, you can just, you know, that song from Lion King that is, Can You Feel the Love Tonight? Yes. You can go and listen to the song as well. Can you feel the love tonight? Wow. Let's see more. My part number three, what's going on here? Okay, what your person is telling you. Uh, wow. Hey, <laughs> wow. Three of Cups, dancing, dancing, dancing. Celebration, enjoyment, okay? So your person is someone, they're like, you know what? I'm ready to celebrate my life with you. I'm ready to celebrate each and every little moment with you. I'm ready to share my good fortune with you. I'm ready to share my gifts with you. I'm ready to show you that I'm ready for love. Okay, look at that. Six of cups. Yes, they're ready for love. Your person is ready for love. Your person is ready to be with you with the six of cups. They're ready to be with you. They're ready to be in this beautiful love connection with you. They're like, oh my God, I can't wait to be with you. I can't wait till we get married. I'm so much excited. I'm so damn excited. I can't wait anymore. So here is the thing, my beautiful part number three, that uh, your person, though they feel that they're getting some kind of illusion, the devil is creating the things are not working out for them but still the next day something good happen and your person is like no things are working out for me so i should not get disappointed okay let's see let's see the messages from universe what is coming up for you my beautiful part number My beautiful pile number three. Uh, yes, this is the one that I'm picking up. Let's see this card. This card is all about um, rest. Okay, rest. I take a step away from my stress and then a deep breath and then a um, crankiness killing nap. <laughs> when I get that rest I need, I instantly become a better version of myself, able to navigate complex relationships in a single bound. When I don't, I'm not, which means I shouldn't, but I try to, and then we can't, and it doesn't, but I do, and it wasn't. Ah, good night. So a person is someone, they're like, sleep, 
sleep sleep is extremely needed for them they were almost feeling restless okay <laughs> your person is like oh my god with that sleep my head is really burning i just want to sleep and i want to become a best version of myself i was i just want to have the best thing in my life and i'm picking up your person is almost like see you in my dream sweetie my pal number three i better go and sleep okay they need sleep they are sleeping they're enjoying their life you, your person is like they work they sleep they pray they do their uh, household chores that's it that is their life okay your person is like i'm not going to spend a single moment with the one who is not my soulmate and i will know immediately if someone is my soulmate or not so your person is quite sensitive to the energies my pen number three i'm picking up so they can feel if someone is their uh, soulmate or not also especially the way they speak very much straightforward extremely straightforward and I'm picking up if they like someone they show it to their words if they don't like someone they also prove it to their words sometimes by number three this person use slang okay and <laughs> it's most of, most of the time your person is angry or maybe whenever they're just too much angry and cannot deal with those jerks your person is just gonna be using their like you know that kind of words and picking up but they're almost like celebrating life with you this is what they want okay celebrating each and every moment with you this is what they like this is what they want okay You can just please go and please listen to the song into the unknown show yourself and circle of life okay mm. you can also go and listen to the song the color of the wind color of the wind yes you can go and listen to the song as well Hmm. Let's see what else is there for you, my beautiful group number. My group number three. Okay, something about your future spouse. Let's see, something about your future spouse. What is coming up for you? What is really coming up for you? What is really coming up for you? Something about your future spouse. Okay, you got the retrograde uh, review okay so your person someone they are almost like they'll have to review whatever they have done and your video process is all about they, they want to look back and judge themselves first before judging anyone and that's the best quality they have so your video process is like it's time for you to see what you have done if that is right or wrong you're going to get it if you review it if you see it again so your video process is also going to have this kind of energy where your person loves to do things the way they used to do and again reviewing it that if this is right and if this is working or not so they are experimental they are open-minded never take anything for granted this is one of their qualities your future spouse will never ever take anything anyone for granted no they will never take anyone or anything for granted your person is like, why would I do that? I would never ever take anything, anyone for granted. Okay? This is not what I should do. I should always respect everyone. I should always um, feel like I'm blessed to have them. Okay, you've got the Sagittarius energy. Your person could be a Sag. Expand, expansion is in them. They have to travel. They have to see the world. Philosophical, religious, open-minded and your person is telling you that i am targeting you and i'm going to get you i'm manifesting you i'll get you because this is i want the venus and beloved they're gonna be very much loving sweet and luxurious as well and this person is going to bring sweetness love romanticizing things in your life this person is ready to start a romantic life with you your fetish process is like yes i'm ready to start a romantic life with you i feel like 
we are meant for each other this person is also letting go of things that was not working out for them if you're drawn to pile number two you can watch pile number two as well your future spouse also telling you that secretly i'm watching you secretly i'm in love with you though it will take some time for you to know me but i already know you your person is someone they are going to surprise you suddenly where you cannot even see where they are coming from your future spouse is trying to tell you that i am ready to marry you i am ready to start a new relationship with you i am coming to marry you i am coming to give you a proper relationship that you can carry on with your life your future spouse is going to be very much clingy and they're like i cannot live without you i want to make sure that you love me too your person is someone they're going to feel extremely confident that you are choosing as their have your wifey your partner is someone you could settle with them in a different country or a far away place i can see settling in a far away place i can see you guys are soulmate okay past life connection is here meant for each other match made in heaven you are manifesting them and they are manifesting you as well both of you could you know um like work together okay this is also i'm picking up pile number three so your person is like you know you can watch that songs or those kind of music video where couples are working together and falling in love okay or just you know uh, like doing romantic things or romantic scenarios while they're working together or while traveling together okay overcoming the challenges just becoming each other's powerful person uh, becoming each other's powerhouse i can see you and your future spouse both of you going to enjoy the sun the beach the the you know the positivity and having a family both of you love to go overseas okay like foreign countries i can also see that this person can wait for you this person can also change their habit for you your future spouse is someone that they are judgmental but a very reliable and non biased judgmental they really judge people the way they are this is the capability your future spouse really have and the way they really judge your personality it is 100% true you're exactly the way they judged you exactly the way uh they thought that you will be i can see it's a past life connection truly i can see you can feel their energy if you're dreaming or if you're meditating pile number 3 you can sense them while you are in your dream or while you are sleeping or something okay you can sense their energy uh this person is going to help you with uh, logical thinking and with ideas your future spouse is trying to tell you that to be the baby type that you always want to be because i will protect your life so, so that you don't have to worry that how others are going to treat you because i will always treat you like my dearest baby my pile number 3 your person what they're telling you right now they're also telling you that about their career this person is doing great okay doing great that doesn't even matter what they do or if they are into career or not but they're just happy with whatever they're having finances yeah that a very happy financial situation right now but your person kind of like you know miss you and they want to be with you they are looking for love they're looking for uh, loyalty and royalty uh pile number three your person is really running the family business or something that their family used to do I can see a person is very successful and people want them in their life. I can see like people are looking up to them and many people see them as a very successful person in life. Your person is the one who is able to give you the true love, the unconditional love that everyone write about in the novel. Your future spouse is telling you that I'm coming in your life as the speed of light, as fast as light. I'm just entering in your life. Though your person is really rejecting many people while coming at you, maybe you're going to reject also one or two. Um, both of you are coming from different world. Could be like you know distance, different country, different religion, different region, culture, uh, ethnicities, ideas, uh, different way of uh, doing things. But you guys are just so much excited to meet each other. So much. Like, your future spouse is like so much excited to be with you. another you know disney story uh, ariel 
Ariel is your future spouse. <laughs> Whether if you are a man or a woman watching this video, doesn't matter. I'm just talking about the energy. Your person's curiosity is like Ariel. Like I wanna be with you. I wanna be with you. Uh, yes, your person is also someone. They got high, high, high romantic feelings. Very much romantic, loving, sweet. Wow. This person loves to dance. Your person loves to dance. Your person loves to dance. Your person loves to party. Your person, your person loves to show other people that what they got with you. Your person is like, I can't wait to be with you. I can't wait to show the world that I got the best person in my life. Wow. I can see a happy family that you are. Okay, Palamitri. I can see a very happy family. That you are becoming with your person, with your future spouse, okay? Your person is like, oh yeah, I'm the, I'm, I'm the happy family. I'm having a really happy, happy life with each other. Um, your future spouse is someone. This is your perfect soulmate, perfect partner, where you really share the heart, the bond, and the past life connection. You guys are just meant for each other. I think the first time you guys are meeting, your person is telling you that I never thought that you are going to be my partner. But we are just meant for each other. I can see we are just meant for each other. Though at the first meeting, it was unexpected for you guys to marry. But let's see. Let's see the card. Let's see the card. Okay. So what you're having? Green gold stone? Okay, let's see the green gold stone do you wish for more luck do you desire safety or of security maintain a mindset that you attract blessings be assured that you have all the good fortune you need at your disposal you have the power to overcome any negativity or challenging situation remember and know that you are divinely protected so yes my pilometry you're divinely protected not only that your future spouse is the one that is extremely protective of you. So physical, mental, spiritual, financial, whatever protection you want, God is going to give that to you through your marriage. Also, you got this card by uh, St. Patrick. I am so incredibly lucky. I am a champion with the ability to overcome any challenges life present. Blessing in my life are plentiful abundance and prosperity continuously flow my way i am safe and divinely protected yes i'm safe and divinely protected i'm powerful universe is going to protect me and my parliament three your relationship is also divinely protected no one can come and get your positivity that easily so that all I got for you, my beautiful pile number three. I hope you enjoyed my reading. Give it a thumbs up. Also, my darling, subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell icon for a new update. Till then, stay blessed and happy. I love you so much. Mwah, mwah, mwah.